Hello everyone, today I'll show you how to make chocolate covered strawberries. For this recipe, you'll need about 10 to 15 strawberries and one cup each of semi-sweet chocolate chips and white chocolate chips. Bring water to a boil and lower the heat. Put one kind of chocolate into the glass bowl. Then take the bowl of chocolate chips and place it over the pot of boiling water. Then you'll use a whisk and a spatula respectively to stir the chocolate chips. The reason you use this method of heating instead of microwaving it is so that you don't burn the chocolate chips. Once you're done melting the chocolate chips, put it in a cup on the side. So take some of the strawberries and then dip them into the cup with the melted chocolate. So after refrigerating it for a little bit, this is what the chocolate covered strawberries will look like. Next, we will do it with the white chocolate. To better control the movement of the strawberry this time, I used some toothpicks. You need to insert the toothpick on the top part of the strawberry like so, and make sure it's firm and straight, and do not push it all the way. You do not want to reach the inner cavity of the strawberry, because that will make your grip on the toothpick and the strawberry loose. Once you set the toothpick up, slowly pull up the leaves of the strawberry and hold it back with the toothpick now inserted into the white chocolate, like so. Here I show this process for the second time. Then take the leftover melted chocolate and put it in a bag. To make it easier, I've taken a sandwich bag and lined it in a cup, and then poured the melted chocolate. Now pull the edges and twist it together. Do it with the chocolate melt too. Then cut the very tip of the bag and start squeezing it on the chocolate covered strawberries. We're going to decorate it as shown. Once you're done with this process, put it in the refrigerator for an hour or two, and then they should be ready to enjoy. Also, if you'd like to make it pink, I found that dropping two drops of red food coloring to half a cup of white melted chocolate makes it pink. Once you have that, use a similar process for this. So let me show you why microwaving doesn't work. I tried microwaving the white chocolate, and it burned. So rather than wasting it, I just use it to make almond candies. So just a pro tip, add one tablespoon of vegetable oil in the one cup of chocolate chip, and microwave in 30 second increments. This way it won't burn. So here are the final products. This recipe will be very useful for Valentine's Day, which is tomorrow. You can make this for your family and friends or other loved ones. Thank you for watching everyone. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next video.